Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise today to speak to the concerns that have been raised to me by my constituents regarding the political climate in Ethiopia, which have also been raised by, in the U.S. by my counterpart, Congressman Chris Smith. What is happening in Ethiopia right now needs to be addressed in the strongest possible terms. Ethiopia is potentially on the verge of civil war and or genocide, and we need to be, or we need to, we are in the position to stop it, but only if we do something more than really rate concerns or call on the Ethiopian government to make genuine improvements. Opposition party leader Dr. Marera Gudina was jailed upon his return to Addis Ababa following a speech he gave to members of the European Parliament condemning the government for its human rights violations. A six-month state of emergency has been declared in an effort to quell dissenters. Thousands of pe peaceful protesters have been killed or imprisoned, and at least 88,000 people have had to flee as refugees or migrants last year alone. What is happening in Ethiopia is being called an abomination, and I encourage this government to take notice and take the strongest possible stand against it. Thank you. Mr.